joining Sharon Cotson. Looking forward to hearing about her runners on Friday. And the odd start in race one with two runners. And they are Swiss Walt, who's improved with each run locally, and Trippie's Tune, who will be stepping out for the first time. And he's a three-year-old gelding by Noble Tune. Morning, Nadine. Swiss Walt, he's been knocking at the door, so expecting another good run from him. Trippie's Tune is his first run. <clears throat> we did give him his gelding before we've um, opted to run him. Um, he does show a lot of pace, so if he's not too green, he can also produce a very good run. We move to race four. We'll see another two runners here. Amazing colours. Well, if you pick up that race card, it tells the whole story. Her last five runs have resulted in that second spot, and Sharon will be praying she can go one better. Almost in Seattle, joins us here on camera. Really, really sweet individual, and Sharon, you'll be hoping for some improvement. Yes, um, amazing colours. Uh, I don't even know what to say anymore. <laughs> we are trying a little bit further, so hopefully they can do the trick. Uh, almost in Seattle, in picture here. We've put the blinkers on. She didn't raise a gallop in her last run, so it was quite a disappointing run. So hopefully with the blinkers on, she puts her act together. In race five, Madam Vicky so narrowly touched off last time out, and that was also over course and distance. Yes, a great run last run. Um, she enjoys the track and the trip. So, you know, if she puts her best foot forward, I think she's quite competitive here. Our feature of the afternoon, the non-black type friendly city stakes over 1,800 metres. Here the yard will step out Bush Tracker and he's in the form of his career. Yes, he is. Um, he's been super consistent in his last couple of runs. He's deserved his spot in the feature. And um, if he puts his best foot forward, um, I think he can give them a go. And in race eight, the yard will close with the two runners, Jean-Paul. He ran on really well to a point over the mile last time out. And Iontel, who races for the yard for the first time, but did run positively locally in his last start. Yes, uh, first run for my yard. Um, he should enjoy the grass. You know, he's got that huge, big action. So um, I think with a long straight as well, that'll be in his favour. So expecting a good run from him. Jean-Paul, going the 1,400 on the grass, um, he has to learn to settle. If he can settle in the early stages, he'll definitely be running on. Let's hope that Jean-Paul settles and can do his best work late, and I'm sure we'll see another positive run from Iron Tail.